This year's Little League World Series Championship looked like a sure win for the U.S. after just the first inning. But the team from Japan, I don't know, had much different plans. Yeah, really. Also, now get this, a pitcher for the Chicago Cubs has accomplished one of the toughest feats in Major League Baseball. And for the third week in a row, straight out of Compton is topping the movie box office. So it bombed. The girls used to love him. What Sad. happened? Is that shame. what happens? You just... Love is fleeting. <laughs> <laughs> You've been watching CNN Newsroom, everyone. I'm Errol Barnett. And I'm Rosemary Church. Do stay with us. Early start is next for our viewers here in the United States. And for everyone else, there's another edition of CNN Newsroom after the break. Welcome back, everyone. Well, not one, but three tropical storms are moving in the direction of East Asia at this hour. And our meteorologist, Pedro Amjeva Harry. Well, excellent news for fans of The Simpsons. Harry Shearer, who brings some of the show's main characters to life, will be back after all. Contract talks with Shearer broke down in May, but Fox now says the man who voices Ned Flanders, Principal Skinner, Smithers and Mr Burns will return. And you have been watching CNN Newsroom. I'm Rosemary Church. Stay with us. Max Foster joins me for the next hour of CNN Newsroom. Don't go anywhere. Yeah. Now, Donald Trump is leading a national poll for the first time in the race for the U.S. presidency. In the suffering, all the oxygen out of the room, as everyone keeps saying, that's going to be a real shocker for the Republicans. Yeah, indeed. Well, U.S. presidential candidate Donald Trump posted a campaign photo to his official Twitter account Tuesday, but it didn't stay up for long. And you, coming to us from Reuters, a German court has announced the verdict in the Oscar Gruning trial. A 93-year-old former Nazi officer has been sentenced to four years in prison. Gruning was accused of 300,000 counts of accessory officer has been sentenced to four years in prison. Gruning was accused of 300,000 counts of accessory to murder. That information just in to CNN. And you have been watching CNN Newsroom. I'm Rosemary Church. And I'm Errol Barnett. Stay with CNN. Early start is next for those of you in the U.S. And for the rest of you, another edition of CNN Newsroom begins after this short break. A sign language interpreter is catching the attention of people around the world with his recent smile-inducing performance at a talent show. Yes, Jeannie Moe shows us how the interpreter seems to sing with his hands. At a talent show. Yes, Jeannie Moe shows us how the interpreter seems to sing with his hands. <laughs> He's got moves like you. <laughs> He's a happy man. He's good. He enjoys good. his job. He does. Okay, it's not unusual for the US talk show host Ellen DeGeneres to ask her guests to show off some of their dance moves yeah. on her program. Okay. The mean tweet was read by 17 million, or watched by 17 million oh, people. Oh, there you go. All right. <laughs> and thanks for watching CNN Newsroom. I'm Rosemary Church. I'm John Wallace. Early starts next for viewers in the United States. Everybody else, stay tuned. Max Foster is in London.